At the Astana Hub International Technopark of IT Startups, the first results of the IT IEL program were announced, featuring presentations of projects by top five participants. This year, a total of 1,300 Kazakh women had the opportunity to acquire programming skills. Most of the participants successfully completed the course in a couple of months and even went on to create their own IT products. Among them is Aliya Orazambetova, a young woman who designed a platform to teach children computer and financial literacy. I have plans to open IT Bala, an educational IT center for preschool children in the city of Astana. I believe it's a great opportunity for free training in no-code programming, as the IT field is highly relevant at the moment. Training throughout the entire program is conducted online for the convenience and accessibility of women on maternity leave. The educational program includes a basic computer literacy course, a freelance school, as well as the no-code and low-code school programs. This is the first cohort of such a program. Training began on the 1st of August and concluded on the 20th of October. Not all participants have completed it yet. This program is aimed at enabling women who may not currently have the opportunity to work full-time outside their homes to earn income online using their skills. No-code and low-code tools allow for the creation of websites, applications, marketplaces, and more based on pre-designed templates. Sites,